Children and Young People Services Committees are called SIPSI for short. They are a place and space for senior managers from education, health, justice, welfare, employment, community and local government to meet together, to plan together and to deliver improved services together in every county in Ireland. SIPSI members are services that work with and for children and young people, including county councils, health services, schools, childcare services, the police, probation services, colleges and universities, family support services, youth services, community development, child and family services and employment and welfare services. SIPSI work is underpinned by the participation of children and young people in decision making. We apply the Lundy model of participation to how SIPSI works. SIPSI play an integral role in the coordination of structures and organisations locally for children and young people and that is key in terms of aligning the efforts of all players from the voluntary community and statutory services to optimise the outcomes for children and young people locally. I think the key role for SIPSI is to bring all the key sta stakeholders together from the statutory voluntary community sector and to ensure that they agree the five national outcomes and agree a strategic plan to improve those outcomes for young people in the county. The real main uh, point of a SIPSI or purpose of a SIPSI is to encourage organisations who work with children and young people to work better together so it's really encouraging a collaborative approach to both identifying what the needs are and then responding to them. I suppose without interagency working you'd have a lot of organisations working in their own silos and the value of interagency working is that communication and collaboration that can happen between the various different organisations to make sure that no children and young people fall between the gaps. I think interagency work makes a huge difference. I think it needs to underpin all our work with children and young people. It means that we get the most out of the resources that we have and sometimes those resources oftentimes are less than we actually need but by pooling them we can really achieve much much more for children and young people. Um, so that's pooling our worker time and our worker resources and also any funding that we have available and just the impact can be so much more when we do that collaboratively. SIPSIs are working really well. In the last number of years they've developed a full national coverage. They're structured along the five national outcomes so there's a shared national agenda which they're working from. Essentially SIPSIs are the go-to and go-through structures for children and young people's services in each local area.